YouTube, welcome into what might be one of the cutest gacha games I have ever played in my entire life. Huge thank you to AFK Journey for sponsoring today's video. And if you've never heard of AFK Journey before, let me tell you what it's all about. AFK Journey is an ethereal fantasy RPG created by the original AFK team. You'll step into Asperia, a fantasy world full of magic, and a lone seed of life meandering among the sea of stars. You play as the legendary mage Merlin and experience strategically tactical battles. Time to dive into an unexplored world and embark on a journey need to unlock a hidden mystery together with the heroes of Asperia. Anywhere you go, magic follows. So remember, only you can guide heroes to pull the sword from the stone and learn the truth about the world. This game is absolutely beautiful. The graphics system is stunning and it can be played on mobile and PC. So if you want to try the game out yourself, you can download it on PC, the App Store and Google Play. And now let's hop into some gameplay so that I can show you this beautifully crafted 3D canvas art world. Okay, so here we go. First time stepping into Asperia. So I'm on the PC client here and it looks like the bottom has a little kind of joystick style movement. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, so the world opens up all bright and colorful. I didn't expect that, actually. I thought it was going to be a little darker. Oh, we got our first battle here, maybe. Oh, oh, it's a cutscene. Oh, God. Wait, they look like evil spirit demons. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, let's see what the battle's all about. So it's an auto battle simulator. Our portrait's lighting up on the bottom. I don't really know what that means fully, but I guess we'll uh, figure that out with the tutorial soon. Okay, so it's very idle combat, it looks like, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. I mean, the game is called AFK Journey, so <laughs> it does make sense. Okay, so we're going to rescue people from the fire in the village here. And take out some elementals in the area. We have a... Oh, so we can move our units across the battlefield as well and add and remove them. Okay, that makes sense. So currently we have Joey, Hogan, and Chippy, which is a little hamster wearing armor. And there we go. That's another battle done. So after each battle, it looks like you do gain some XP and currency are called AFK rewards, which is quite nice. Oh god, another cutscene. The animation's really pretty. I like it. I, I find this animation style really cute. Even though what's happening isn't cute, the animation style is pretty cute. It's also really well made. Oh, who is this? Valen. Not the beauty sleep. Valen. Valen. Okay. Here now? Where are you <laughs> Bro's been drinking. Ah, so it looks like the fire elementals are a big problem here. Uh, ooh, who is this character coming up? The... Ooh, the redhead. Okay, interesting. I saw you casting a spell with my own eyes. It's not that easy to... Ooh, I like her voice. Fire, my dear. I'm just trying to help. Interesting. Scarlet Sorceress. That's what the rumors say. Dangerous. You're quite right. If this were my fire, you'd all be ashes by now. <laughs> so she's the Scarlet Sorcerer. Oh wow. Okay, so she uh she's strong. You're... She's powerful. Oh god, Chippy. He's a hamster. Oh, she's looking at me. I don't know, step. Yeah, gaze back. Never mind. Huh? You made me think of someone. The divination was right. This night. Oh, maybe she awful. knows who we are. Do we know I each other? Gone out. Wind's Suddenly loud. Maybe a storm's loud. approaching. Oh, another cut scene. Wait, maybe there is a storm. Oh God. Oh, that's a that's a big tornado. Yeah, I don't think she's the bad guy. Something tells me. All right, we got this. I'll heal everyone. Ooh, we get to use her now. Okay, let's put her... Since she's a mage, we'll put her in the back. I assume that's probably going to be the best uh, battle formation. And then this thing... Oh, God. This tornado does a lot of damage. Oh, no. It's a good job we're a very good healer, apparently. Okay, all these portraits are still lighting up. Let me... Let me try and figure out what I can do here. This is just the awakening spell, uh, which is also adding up. So that activates, that's when we can heal, I see. As soon as that bar fills up, uh, the main character heals the rest of the team. Okay, everybody's lit up. That didn't do anything. Uh, maybe... What if I click? Okay, Mary. Oh, it's like a, it's an ultimate ability. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, that makes so much sense. So the game is pretty AFK, but you can be more active in the combat if you want to be. 
Dude, the cutscenes are really good. I like the voice acting in the cutscenes. Oh god. Oh. Oh wait, we're having an anime moment. What is this? What the hell? <laughs> that's uh that's a facial expression right there. Damn, wait, we're powerful, powerful. Oh wow. Oh, turn, yeah, time to pass out. This Scarlet Witch person seems to care for us a lot more than a random stranger would. I'm curious. You awake? How are you feeling? I'm feeling pretty damn good. Oh, uh, I, I'm not sure if That's I know the Scarlet Sorcerer. I, 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 we lost all our memories and uh, we're starting from scratch, basically. Okay, let's go ahead to see Dolly. Back. We're back. I was worried. We're home. What is this? Is that another hamster? Merlin. Merlin. That's the reveal. Well, I guess the, the in-game reveal. I guess we reg regained our powers, but we kind of passed out after, so. Okay, honestly, the gameplay is really nice. It's quite smooth. Obviously, it's very AFK. You don't have to pay too much attention, which I really, really like, honestly. You can always play it on the side while doing something else, but the story is intriguing enough to, to make me want to pay attention, so. Now, let's check this out. This is this looks like it's the uh, the wishing system, the, the hero recruitment system. So we have epic recruitment, which we don't have any currency for just yet. I assume you get that through the story. And then hero recruitment, uh, where we can just start doing temples, I guess. So let's have a look. First temple. Our, is, is our good luck going to carry over into other gacha games? Let's take a take a look here. Oh! Wait, that looked like two four stars and a five star. Or at least two purple rarity and a gold rarity. Ooh! Salazar, he looks pretty cool. Oh, damn, Viperion. Wait, they look sick. Wait, I love the kind of necromantic uh, theme. I didn't expect that from this game. A uh, couple of three stars. Okay, as expected. I didn't expect there to be hamsters, though, but that's pretty cute. Oh, and the five star. Dude, yeah, the, the green and dark vibes. I like this. Cecia or Cecia. Be grateful that you're allowed an audience. She looks cool as hell. I'm pretty happy with that temple, honestly. Let's do another one, though. We have a few. Three purple rarities. Okay, let's hope to get some uh, new characters here. I'd like to get some new characters to be able to test out some of the other ults and see how strong they are. Lucius, the light bearer. He looks pretty cool. Happy with that. Oh, we got Nairu. Dude, yeah, I'm in love with this kind of aesthetic. I, I really expected it to be more bright and bubbly. Oh, speaking of bright and bubbly, Damien. I just had a great idea for a new contraption. Oh, he's got a cute little glider. Okay, and let's do the final one. Oh, another five star. Wait. Another gold rarity character. Hold on. Please don't be a duplicate. Please be somebody new. Are the potions ready? We got customers coming. <laughs> Smoky and Mirky or Murky. Pretty interesting. I like the idea of a kind of duo character. That's pretty cute. Ah, oh, we did get a dupe, Damien, but that's fine. Dupes, dupes might be really good in this game. We need to track. Okay, so the duplicates we could use to ascend different characters here to give better base stats. And I assume it scales when you level them up as well. You get more power over the entire party. And one of the great things about this game is kind of the... the easy progression system in terms of equipment you can just fast equip everything to make sure you're not missing out on anything or if you want to be more thorough with it go into it and, and equip things yourself but it's very easy to keep up the date with the progression and the gear system and keep your power levels high because you don't need to build every single character you build just the different roles like tank assassin and stuff like that okay so we're in a new open world area here we got a waystone so we can we can uh teleport okay interesting let me get some chests. Ooh, an epic invite letter. That's pretty cool. And then let's get into battle. I want to test out some of these new characters. So let me... Obviously, we'll keep the main character on. But I want to add the five-star characters. And then mm, I, I definitely want to add some of the newer four-stars. The necromantic-feeling ones. So I want to see what they can do. Uh, so let's take a look at this. Oh, what are these barrels as well? Can I... Uh... Oh, I can click them. I can click them to blow them. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. Again, it's very AFK, but there's some things that you can do if you would like to progress the battles faster, which I do really like, such as the ultimates and clicking on the terrain, uh, the destructibles and things like that. It's really nice. 
Can I? Uh, oh, I can set this one off before the battle even start. And then we just take one out. Easy. Okay. Nice. A bit of treasure as well. Always good. And then what is this? Elite challenge. Uh-oh. This guy might be difficult. Oh, this guy has four health bars. Okay. Oh, next to the, the area name as well, it looks like you've got coordinates. So I guess if you want to, like, tell your friends where a certain elite mob is, you can just send the coordinates. That's pretty nice. Oh, big damage, actually. Oh, yeah. This team is cracked. This team's absolutely insane. Even at lower level. Another big chest with a lot of loot, including wishing currency. Okay. And now let's try this battle. This is a cool one, because I, I guess you can set up your characters in areas where the enemies can't even hit you because of the walls. But honestly, I think at this point, I'm just going to try and build up it's ults to test them out. So let's have a look at Valens. Oh, bro just zooms in. Okay, he is an assassin, so it does make sense. So that's AFK Journey. Honestly, I find it really cute and a lot of fun. Again, it's a game that you can pretty much play on your side monitor while doing other things, or you can pay heavy attention to get involved in the story and enjoy the beautiful art style. So if you are interested, again, make sure you download the game, especially upon the global launch, where there'll be a ton of giveaways for all heroes, including Epic and Elite, and over 200 free draws. Just check the links down in the description below so you can keep up to date with the game through socials and try it out yourself. Thank you again to AFK Journey for sponsoring the video. I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.